Where are we headed to, driver? No man's land. <laughs> oh, okay, they're going then. <laughs> we got a damn good show for you tonight. What do you say, Jane? Yeah, we got a damn good show. Let's get her done. <laughs> All right. Good day, YouTubers. Welcome to another video. This morning, I've come up to a spot where I was digging a bunch of marbles down in there. Marbles and vintage, little vintage plastic toys and stuff like that. I've come up the way here a little bit. And I'm going to be digging up in here today. Now, the stuff up in here looks to consist of basically the same sort of stuff that was down in that other section with all the marbles. I mean, there's lots of little toy stuff coming out of here. Check out that shoe. Look, some of those, a bunch of those come out down on that other section. There's a piece out of a light bright. So there's looks like there's lots of plastic stuff here. So I'm going to dig around here and we'll see what comes out. Hang tight. Well, I've been doing a heck of a lot of digging lately, folks. I'm even down to the old uh, honey hole and starting a new hole down there. And that requires a lot of digging. And I ain't even come close to getting the hole the size that it was before it caved in last year. If you go back on my videos, you can see uh, footage of Jane standing in front of the hole. And it's like a massive entrance to it. And then once you're inside, it went off to the left and to the right. So it's huge. The hole I got going there now was minute compared to it, like just enough that I can get in it, and that's it. When I talk about that, let's see what's in the hole right here. See that? Look at that. A glass doorknob. Beauty. First time I've dug a glass doorknob. Awesome, awesome, awesome. A couple little chips on it, but nothing serious. Great find. That's nice. What I'm doing is raking this stuff back, folks, and I'm scooping it up and firing it up here on the bank where it's already where I've already checked up there. Just to keep it out of the way, try to get a little hole going here. Got a little coin right here. Looks like an American penny. Might be a wheat cent. I think it is. Anyways, I'll take it and clean it up. Have a better look at it. All right, I got a little mini find here, folks. See if you can spot it. Actually, look at this. I got another one right here. Just seen that. That's a weightlifter. I would say his base is broke off, though. Still neat, though. I'll probably hang on to it, but right down in here. I just spot it right on the surface, though. A little plastic cowboy and it is tiny look how tiny he is <laughs> got the guns ablaze in there looks like he would have attached to a horse neat oh that would be easy to miss that guy as tiny as he is all right let's keep going see there seems to be very similar stuff up in this section as was down in the other Put those finds right there. Plastic carrot. 
First time I've dug up a carrot. <laughs> well, a plastic one, anyways. Hey, hey, hey. Well, I thought I'd get a step back here and give you a look at what I'm doing. You can see my shovel there for size reference. So I got an area cleared out there and I'm just firing it up over the hill here. And once I got enough there cleared out, I can just start raking that back without having to shovel it to get my drift. And another thing, folks, right along, see, as you see the rocks here, it's right along a rock ledge around here. I don't know about anywhere else, but it seems there's an awful lot of dump sites right over ledges and amongst big rocks so that's a little tip there you can something to look for look around big rocks and over ledges well as you can see i'm making some progress here folks i am heating up though this is a lot of work a lot of work getting a place like this started look at this if i'm not mistaken viewers if you watch some of my other digs from this site but way down through the woods that way i'm pretty sure i dug up the other half of this way down there i'm going to take that see if it matches up and if it does i will definitely keep you updated very cool Here's one of these Pepsi-Cola bottles. These things are all over the place down here. As I mentioned in a previous video, check it out. I don't normally keep them, so they're from the late 60s or early 70s. The place is loaded with them. Look at that Pepsi-Cola cap liner just come out. Look, it's got the date on it, 1974. It's a Z. I wonder what I was spelling. Pizza? Really hoping to get into some marbles here, folks. <laughs> uh, let's just come out. Uh, alligator. Looks like he'd float. Maybe go in the bathtub. Oy, oy, oy. Hope the fines get better. seen a little yellow something or other fall right down in here right there yeah look it's a goose a little plastic goose right on you see what I plan on doing folks is taking all these little finds like this that I get down here I'm gonna put them all in a big jar all from the site this place is loaded with little stuff like this. That's a neat little find. You know, look at this that just came out. Oh, it's got a Bronco and a cowboy on it, a bucking Bronco. I'm guessing it would have been a little flag, but it's all broke. That's too bad. See, there's all kinds of stuff like this in here. Well, this has just come out. Little container. This is Lynx Glitter. Try to get it focus there. Oh, it's still full of the glitter. Ooh. Trying to get focused on it, but anyways, there it is. Lynx Glitter. Non-toxic. It's like Clifton, New Jersey, maybe? Huh. Well, folks, after a heck of a lot of digging here, I can come back, show you the size of the hole there now stretches away up around that way 
Oh, yeah, yeah. I think I got a marble. Right here. And it isn't even down at the bottom. It's up near the top. Yeah, a nice green cleary. Where's that sun at? Yeah. Beauty. One for the pocket. Awesome. Awesome possum. <laughs> That's one of the Wade figurines. Red Rose Tea figurines. Sweet. All right. Good find, good find. Well, I looked that uh, Red Rose Tea figurine up and it's a hedgehog. You can pick one of them up at your local shop for probably a buck or two. It's not one of the more rare ones. Well, these are in here. So far, they've all been broken. Old homestead. I got a little animal figurine here. Oh, it's a cow. It's laying down. I wonder if that's... That almost looks like that material that glows in the dark once it's out in the sunlight. I wonder if it is. Remember that stuff? Neat little find. I'll hang on to it. Well, folks, I was really hoping to get into a bunch of marbles here today, but this is a huge area. That's what I dug up today. That's a lot. Yeah, I just ventured over here to have a look around. And, uh, Oh, there's a hand right there. Where'd it go? Right in here. Look at that. And a little play set. Hong Kong, it says on the base. That's a neat little find. I'm going to head down to where I usually find the marbles, and I'm going to scratch around there for a bit before I can get out of here. Well, I wasn't here long, folks, as you can see. Scratch there and down there. Not my first one right here. Oh, no, it's busted. That would have been nice, too. With the color in that. Well, I was about to get out here, folks, but I couldn't resist digging around a little bit more. I think I got a friggin' smoker of a marble here. Look at that. That is nice. Yep, I'm glad I stuck around. Zoom in. Yeah. Beauty. All right, now I guess uh, get a go. <laughs> Talk to you later. Thanks for watching. Thumbs up, comment down below. See you all in the next one. Okay, now put your hands at 10 and 2 in the steering wheel for me. That's not 10 and 2. There you go. And this one on 10, please. Nope, your right hand on 2. Why don't you put your left hand right here, please? Left hand, that's your right hand. Now put your right hand right there. No, now put this one right here and leave that one there. Okay. Where are we headed to, driver? No man's land. <laughs> oh, okay, they're going then. <laughs> We got a damn good show for you tonight. What do you say, Jane?